what is up guys welcome to software learning so today in this video i'm going to be teaching you how to install mac os mojave 10.14 operating system in your vm workstation 15 pro so this is a very simple method to install this you can check other videos on youtube uh, they're telling you in different ways or maybe in difficult ways but in this video i'm going to be teaching you in this very very simple way so you can install this in few minutes so without wasting any further time Time. let's get jump into this tutorial so you guys need these two files which is unlocker master and mojave image and this is a mac operating system file here so it's size about 6.18 gb i'll put the link in description uh, so you can download these files and also you need vm workstation pro 15 i have 15 so i'll also put the link in description of this software so first of all you need to extract this unlocker master so whenever you install vm workstation pro you trying to install a mac os there is no option for installing apple mac os we need to unlock that option so we can install mac os mojave 10.14 in vmware workstation pro so first of all extract unlocker master and simply click on we open this folder and simply right click on this win install and open this run as administrator click on yes and here we go this will close automatically so you need to just wait you must have internet connection so you can download these files here you can see that these uh, files are downloading in this tools folder so guys here you can see that four files copied and starting vm services and this will close automatically and here you go close automatically now simply open your vm workstation and also extract this mojave image and i already extracted this here you can see that i have files uh, 9.8.98 gb size of this file and now simply open vm workstation pro so after opening this i already have a mac os and elementary os so i'll install a new so simply click on file and click on new virtual machine select typical and click on next and here uh, click i will install the operating system later and simply click on next so here you can see that apple mac os x so here is the option we just unlock it and here is a uh, mac os variants so simply we have a mojave uh, 10.14 variant so simply select this one and click on next now put the name of your virtual machine and browse the location where you wanna install this and I'll simply install it here and make a new folder and ok and click on next and here you can see that maximum disk size now you need to select uh, about 40 GB you can select and recommended size from Mac OS is 40 GB and we have a maximum disk size is 40 GB so it's ok so store virtual disk as a single uh, click on this option and simply next if you want to your Mac OS run fastly so just increase this maximum disk size and simply click on next and now click on customize hardware now for mac os you need to be set uh, this memory of virtual memory on 4 gb so it's a half of uh, my computer uh, i have a 8 gb ram and this mac os will use 4 gb whenever i open this software and open this operating system and try to use this and uh, click on processor and we click on this and this is also half of it half of my uh, computer so simply that's all now click on close and click on finish so now simply here you can see that mac os and now you if you click on play on this virtual machine uh, this will giving you an error now we need to do some work here so now you need this uh, code here you can see that this code smc dot variant so simply copy this and i'll also put this in description so you can copy it and go to the location where you uh, install and here you can see that now simply click on mac os 10.14 virtual machine configuration so right click on it and open with notepad so go to the end point and simply click enter and control v so here you can see that just do like this and simply click on save save this and now open your vm workstation and simply click on virtual machine and here you can see that hard disk option so here you can see that current size of our operating system is 5.1 MB so it's mean we haven't select 
our right file so simply we click on this hard disk and simply click on remove and now we'll add again and click on hard disk the recommended is SATA so we click on SATA and use an existing virtual disk uh, because we already have and this is here this is already we have a virtual file disk so click next and now browse that file I have this on desktop and I'll browse this and simply select this and click on open and click on finish and now simply click on convert and here we go all is done now simply click on ok and now we click on power on this virtual machine so this virtual machine will be powering on and here we go here you can see that our mac os operating system is going to be installing and here is the apple logo so if you have 8 gb ram or 6 gb ram or so i'll suggest you that please close all your programs like Google Chrome and other programs like IDM and those programs are opened already open in your simply click on task manager and you can see those programs here so simply close that and your RAM will be more free to than your Mac OS operating system be will be run faster so here uh, I have 2.2 GB available so here we need to set up our uh, mac os operating system so simply we select united states click on continue and choose a keyboard layout will be us so click on continue I want to transfer your information don't transfer any uh, i don't want to transfer any information to this mac so i'll simply select this option and no sign with your apple id so we don't have apple id so simply we will click on setup later and click on skip now here is the terms and condition you we need to agree this and simply click on agree and click on agree again so now put your computer name or your name this is our account name and this is our password now you can hint any hint i'll put this as a hint and simply click on continue and your account will be creating so express setup so simply click on continue and now choose your look if you want dark region or light simply click on that i i click on dark so i'll click on continue and here we go setting up your mac and this will be setting up so guys finally here we go here's our mac os Mojave 10.14 is installed on our VMware workstation Pro 15 so here you can see that it's working and I'll simply click on this icon click on this about this Mac and here you can see that here is our processor RAM and display is 3 MB right now so now we need to install a VMware tools so I'll simply click on this uh, VMware option and click on install VMware tools and now this will be installed on your Mac so here you can see that simply click on install VMware tools uh, so this VMware tools will help you to make your screen in full resolution like uh, your your LCD or your monitor so I'll click on continue if I'll click on full screen and here you can see that this is a full screen of this uh, Mac OS right now so after installing this tool this will be uh, this uh, black surface will be not show here and will be removed this black surface will be removed so I'll simply click on install and click on continue installation and this will be installation so just you just need to so just need to wait for this installation so here I need to put my password of my machine and after that I click on install software So while installing this software there is a message will be popped up like system extension block so simply click on open security component and simply click on this allow button we all need to do here so cut this and this will be installation will be continued so our VMware tools installed successfully and simply click on restart So guys uh, we need to put our password here so I simply click here and put my machine password and simply click on enter so now after opening your Mac OS and restarting it there is will be a message will be popped up like this and now simply click on open security preferences and simply click on allow 
and after allowing this shut down after restarting your mac os now try to reinstall that vmware tool so simply click on reinstall and click on install vmware tools again do, again do that do those steps and click on continue and here put your password So this time we reinstall that VMware tool so simply click on restart. So guys after reinstalling that VMware tools now simply click on enter full screen mode. So now you can see that our Mac OS operating system is running in full screen mode. So before you can see that the resolution of our, our Mac OS operating system is not in full screen mode. So if we try to enter it will not on that uh, full screen mode. So now we'll click on about this Mac. Here you can see that there is a 128 MB and we will click on display and here you can see that 1920 multiplied 1080p 13.5 inch. So guys in this way you can install mac os mojave 10.14 in your virtual machine so that's is the video so i hope you like this video if you like this video thumbs up and if you had any problem in this video or else let me know in the comment box goodbye